Hi there, Gloria Hickox back again with a cute little door idea. You know, there's two places that you can really make a, a significant difference when you're seasonally decorating. One is your front door and the other is centerpieces. So we're gonna be talking about those as well. But um, I talked a little bit earlier about some mileage pieces. Mileage pieces to me are those pieces that you invest in and then you have those and you can use them lots of different places and you can use them forever. So one of the mileage pieces that I like is our thin wall pocket with the uh, seagrass. So this is made of seagrass. It is handmade, hand woven with natural seagrass. And that one is thin enough that if you have a storm door and screen door, um, that will fit in between there. So I just very simply added a bow to the front and then filled it with a couple of the florals that are actually on sale for October. So you can get that entire look, plus this does have a handle, let me show you here in the back that you can hang that with. You can get that entire look for just a couple dollars over 50. And so all you need to do from there on out is just change the florals that you see and keep that basket on your door. Now, once you purchase that, you have qualified yourself for the customer special. And one of the customer specials is our Homestyle Oval Tray Basket, which you can see here with this centerpiece. You can add this basket to your order for just $14 with a $30 purchase. And you can get as many as you want. Now make sure you check out the other customer special that Signature Homestyles has for you for October as well in an upcoming post. But this centerpiece may be on your dining room table. Um, very easy to remove when you're ready to put food on the table because you can just pick up the basket and um, take it away. So we're using the uh, flower bucket in the galvanized, but it's also giving you the brown tones and the galvanized gray tones with it. And the cotton, I have two different um, florals in there. The cotton and floral picks, which we have there. And then the mini blooms, which we have here. I also liked to add a little bit of light, especially in the evening when that comes on. Those are on a timer as well. You, that will light up on your dining room or your kitchen table. Be very, very pretty for the evening. And I just used also in there the um, amber sparkle glass cylinder that you did see just a little earlier. And then just tucked in some of the warm mix hydrangeas just to um, add some life to that. Now that's a pretty tall centerpiece, so great for a dining room table when you're not eating. But how about your coffee table? Let's move on over here, and we're gonna use the uh, Parkside tray, which is great. I love making centerpieces inside a tray, a basket, some type of a base, so they're easily moved when, need, when they need to be. So the Parkside tray is a wooden tray with your metal handle pieces on each side, and I've just tucked in our leaf cylinder from in the back corner, took our gorgeous blessings block and put that right catty corner tucked our little jack-o-lantern pumpkin now remember he doesn't come with those eyes and mouth um, you can use the black electrical tape to actually cut that out and pop that on there and they do peel right back off and then some um, life in this one is actually added by our set of three succulents so I hope that has been very helpful but those two things, if you do your front door and you do your center pieces, that will definitely give your home a great fall look whenever you're trying to achieve that. Bye for now.